Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the Ola Maxima for today's concert. Um, so, just a couple of words about a few things. So, um, the exits, I guess, needless to mention, but just for the record, obviously the one over here is also one at the back on the left. In the event of anything happening, which I don't think it will happen, considering it's never happened in 25 years. But just for the record, these are the exits. Um, next week, we're back down in the Glucksman. We were there last week, and uh, next week we have some early music where we're collaborating with the East Cork Early Music Festival. So it's fantastic. It's uh, great music. Please do come along. Uh, come early. <laughs> uh, not too early. When I say early music, it's not like a 6 a.m. start or anything. It's kind of uh, sort of lunchtime. So uh, great to see you all. Lovely turnout here. Um, so I'm going to ask my colleague Kelly to introduce on the musicians because I don't think I could do very, a good, very good job on the pronunciation. So Kelly is going to introduce on today's concert. I want to welcome Michael and Mary who are our helpers this year. And great to see you there at the door there. So if you have any, any questions or queries, um, you can just go to Michael or Mary. It doesn't necessarily even have to be about the concerts. It might be about your personal life, anything at all. They're absolutely <laughs> wonderful. The last thing I'll say before Kelly comes on, I think it's very important today particularly, if you could remember to turn down the phones, please, you know, put them onto some kind of a silent or, or maybe just turn them off because there'll be a lot of very gentle uh, sounds up here, so it would be a shame if a phone went off in the middle of that. So uh, here's my wonderful friend and colleague, Kelly Boyle. Thank you very much. Um, it's lovely to see you all. I think this is my first time back in the aula in person for a FUM concert for a very, very long time, uh, so it's really very special. Um, it's also a real um, pleasure for me to introduce today's artists to all of you. Um, you'll hear a Vina performance by Professor Karakudi S. Subramanian. Um, he is a master Vina player and a leading exponent of the Karakudi Vina tradition of South India. We had a wonderful um, research seminar in the Department of Music yesterday morning, um, I know many of you were with us for that, um, where we learned about Professor's um, music and his teaching. So he's, a, he's a, a performer, a musician, an educator, and uh, a world traveler, I think it's fair to say. Um, they've just come from Limerick, and they're on their way to Dublin next week. Um, even though it's Sir's third time in Cork, it's his first time performing here in the Aula Maxima. And some of you might know that um, the Navaratri festival, the Hindu festival of Navaratri, ended just two days ago. And I think there's something very auspicious about that and being able to welcome the Professor here today. He's joined by two of his students, Matariga Thivapalan and Tanuga Thivapalan. And I'm delighted to say that we have a special connection with Tanuga. Um, because very recently she graduated with her Master's in Research from UCC in which she did an extensive study of the Karakudi Veena tradition which you're going to hear some performances of now. Without further ado, please join me in welcoming Professor Karakudi Subramanian, Tanuga and Mathura. Normally when you go to India, you'll find the drums part of that. The violin is accompanying a lot of instruments there. It's very, very rare for you, for me also, for us, just to play veena, the sound of the veena. So it just suits my temperament, because I love to listen to the, just the sound. The drums are beautifully accompanying and uh, uh, doing that, but unless we work together, not the full concert. It's just a, in that respect, it is an informal concert. I would say even concert is just a performance. 
and I'm very happy that my students are here. And I'm going to play three compositions. One 18th century composer, Jagraja, and then rest 20th century. The first composition is by the 20th century composer. The next composition, the second composition is the 18th century composer, which is going to be the main feature of our performance. The last one is by Lalguli Jayaraman, who is also the same 20th century composer, but he died quite, quite recently. One of, the, one of the brilliant composers, performer, and also a scholar in his own rights. So we are going to just present the compositions with some improvisation, which is not rhythmic with a tarla, such as a metric cycle, but it is simply freely rhythmic and one just melodic. So hope you enjoy, hope we perform, man, right? to give you the best of ours. Thank you. The first raga is called a Dharmavati. The tarla, Rupaka tarla, the three beat cycle.
This is a raga called the third year. The church mode is Phrygian mode, but the gamakas, the movement, are around those tones, but giving entirely a different feeling. You won't be able to. Those who can hear, you won't be able to find which notes they are. They are, they are touching and going. Like this. It's a very, very difficult raga in that respect. And the composition is a very beautiful composition. One of the five gems, as they would call it, of Tyagraja, the 18th century composer. Composed in Lalgudi, that's a village in Tanjore. This will be preceded by Raga Alapana, starting with Teruga, then be following her. That's followed by an improvisation called Thanam which is very special in our tradition, which is a nine, nine generation old tradition, is very special. So I'm going to offer an improvisation in five different ragas, ending with the raga Thodi and the composition. So it will be a long story spent, so and then finally the composition will end this concert. Thank you. 
we're going to begin the composition now.
It's good. Second experience I have after my performance in the observatory a long time ago in Amherst, where my hand really froze. So it's really freezing, but still we could make it. <laughs> Thank you very much for your audience.